My name is Anson, I'm the project manager for pg and &E for the distribution gas side of it. And uh, we're just here to describe you know, our scope, why we're in the city, and also uh, the material that we're putting in the ground. So um, you can kind of touch and feel and see what we're putting in the ground. So that's why we're here, making sure that the public is, uh, understands what we're doing and they feel uh, comfortable with what we're doing. So that's why we're here. My name is Frank Perioni, I'm a public safety specialist with Pacific Gas and Electric, and I'm here to talk to you about gas safety. <coughs> how to turn off your meters if you have a problem with your meters, how to turn off your gas valves in, at home, and when to call 811 to do a dig. So when you dig out in your yard, the requirements to call 811 prior to your digging for safety in the community and safety of your home. A uh, simulation of what could happen when you don't utilize 811. Call before you dig, know what's below. Because you never know what utilities you might dig into, especially the gas line or the electric line, that could cause fire or explosion. California law says that any time you put a shovel in the ground, if you dig, excavate, site bore, you must call that number 811 two days before commencing your job. So once the facilities are marked with the proper identification of red, electric, yellow, gas, blue, water, green sewer, orange, phone, then you can proceed with that job. Utilize 811 to eliminate potential hazards. Just some uh, Dylan Mills. I'm with Underground Construction. I'm a project manager. Uh, I've been in the industry for a couple years now. Um, and you guys don't want big construction equipment operating and tearing it up, making loud noises all the time. We understand that, and that's why we're going to try to do this with uh, as little impact to you guys as possible. And that's that's been the main concern: people being able to get in and out of their houses, in and out of their businesses, and to be in the certain sections where we'll be working downtown for the local. Uh, traffic that's going to come through here from the tourists, from people from out of town, to make sure that they're going to be able to get into these businesses. And that's where we work um, diligently to make sure that we uh, maintain access to all businesses, houses, community, whatever whatever you need to get to, we're, we'll do what we can to make sure you're not impeded. So we're going to be putting in this plastic pipe, which is a polyethylene high density pipe um, that is built to withstand just about anything you can throw at it. And uh, it's going to be going in in a uh, routine maintenance program. We're basically upgrading the system um, to last longer. And uh, hopefully it will be done with as little effect to the public as possible. Community has this unbelievable beach. You've got this unbelievable history and all this. Your industry is based, or your local industry is very much based off of people coming here and it being beautiful.